Alright, so the mod creator asked me to make another video because he is continually updating the uh, mod, which is really good to see. So now we're up to already version 1.2. So uh, 1.2 adds a dark rainbow mode. There's already a fair few modes, as you can see, there's already a fight happening here. We'll just watch this while I'll talk to you a bit about it. There's a rainbow mode, which is really easy, which just um, spawns no Jamora or anything like that. Then there's a, a dark age, which is really, really difficult, which is what, what I actually used during my um, uh, first two videos uh, when I was showing you guys. Uh, just to... Just to Oh, these guys going to attack me? No, they're not. Thankfully, they're not going to attack me. But, um, so, that's what I showed. There's a lot more spawns, um, a lot more enemies spawning at the same time. What the hell is that over there? Is that like a deer up in the air? It looks like it. So, um, and that was really hard with the, um, more enemies spawning in the same place and things like that. And then, now there's this dark rainbow mode. So, uh, you never really know what's going to happen in this mode. You can be running around in a forest for a couple of hours and not find anything, and then when you're heading back home, you can get, you can get killed by anything uh, instantly and things like that, which is which is pretty good because it actually like makes you more scared. You don't, you, you're not expecting to get like actually killed, but it's more of a surprise if you find something along the way. So it's not like you with the um. So what I'm trying to say is basically with the Dark Age mod. Uh, you could be running and you'd basically be expecting to find random stuff happening like random fights You'd basically be guaranteed to find something but with this dark rainbow mode It makes it a lot less likely for you to just find random things fighting against each other uh, Which is pretty good and also there's uh, different falls um, uh, Amounts that you fall um, your fall damage is changed up a bit so you, your fall damage is increased by two but your enemy's fall damage is increased by three, so it gives you some uh, new options for more tactics and things like that. Let's see if we can. So as you can see, I'm just walking around. I haven't absolutely haven't found absolutely anything. But with the Dark Age uh, portion of the mod, if I actually had that installed, you definitely find something more uh, happening. Uh, so what else happens? There's a um, so the spawn sometimes turn off. Oh, something's shooting at me. The hell. Looks like he's coming from over here somewhere. Whoa. It's not a dragon. Ah, oh, there it is. So as you can see, there's a good couple of mammoths and there is... I have no idea what that is. Some mage. Well, there's a... It looks like there's another mage in the water. He's, he's struggling. So, so we'll be back and so I'll show you a couple more What else has improved in the version 1.2 is a lot of you guys that were higher up in the levels were complaining that all you guys could find were Dremora and things like that. So it was basically just really really boring just seeing the same thing over and over again the same enemies so that's changed with uh 1.2 i was level 100 uh just then and obviously you could see mammoths and uh mages fighting against each other which was pretty cool so it's a lot more immersive it's not you know, it's not as likely that you'll find random stuff uh right now i'm level 9 i obviously use player set level and we just came out of road set and we are killing some wolves so it's not like you'll find just random stuff like Dramora everywhere. It, it obviously scales to whatever level you are. And let's just run up around here. I'm sure we'll find something. There we go. So, there, so there's a banded outlaw now. So uh, if I was level 100, you'd find something much more challenging than, um, than a banded outlaw. Let's see if there's anything else. Oh, there's something up, else up here. Who's this guy? Is he killing me? He's not killing me. He's a scavenger. Nice. He, so he helped me and now he's going to kill me now. So anyway guys, make sure you check uh, version 1.2 out. It's been updated and it's good to see that the mod creator Alexandro is continually upgrading his um, mod. So thanks for watching this. Guys. I was just running around and look at this massive fight. This is probably the best part of the mod. You just run around. You never know what you're going to find with version 1.2 as well, which is good to see. There's nothing that's too overpowered. 